Hello, my name is George Cook. I'm a little over halfway through the MASD program. I just completed my mid-program review, so my thesis project has been approved and I'm starting to work on it. I put together a little talk that takes you through my professional background, where I'm at school, and where I see things going. So, hope you enjoy it. For most of my career, I've been getting schools to embrace and deploy technology. In fact, my first job out of college in the mid-1980s was teaching kids how to program in Logo on Apple II computers. It's amazing how much technology has changed and the rich resources that are literally at the learner's fingertips. I've worked with K-12 and higher education institutions all over the United States. From a sustainability perspective, I've been trying to travel less, communicating electronically whenever I can. I was shocked in the first semester when I learned about the eco footprint due to my air travel. From a school perspective, one of my first projects looked at the darker side of solar PV and explored emerging bio-based alternatives. Last semester, I created a co-cycle program that pitched bicycle commuting. The car culture in our country is starting to change with the sharing economy, but that won't be enough in my opinion. Communities are starting to include cyclers in their design, but we have a long way to go. Projects like ecodistricts.org give me some hope. A keystone project for me in the MASD program has been a collaboratively created ebook on water. I'm evolving this work into a project-based learning curriculum for my thesis. This book includes content from The Big Thirst, Charles Fishman's excellent book. In the book, he tells amazing stories, all about water's unique properties and how we take advantage of them. In my research, I also learned how the natural cycle of life are all entangled with every aspect of the water cycle. We often take water for granted, but we always depend on it. There are over 4 billion people in the world today facing fresh water shortages, and water in the United States is our most degraded natural resource. I believe that understanding this water situation is an ideal gateway for engaging learners and communities in sustainability and giving them the motivation to take action. Bigger picture, the ground we've covered in the MASD program sometimes discourages me. The complex spectrum of human activity, social, economic, and environmental, all seem to be headed in the wrong direction. But on the flip side, there are endless possibilities for improvement. Every day I find inspiring people and projects. I'm encouraged by the work of other students and hope that I'll be able to make my own contributions.